Well, I'll be listing on eBay soon this uh, Singer 306K. Uh, it works, but the motor seems to make a clicking sound. So I'm listing it uh, for repair. Comes with lots of good stuff, ruffler and attachments. Comes with a straight stitch uh, foot there. And that's the straight stitch plate, embroidery, I'm sorry, embroidery plate there. And then that's the, um, I don't know if you can see it there, it's the plate for, for zigzag. Comes with the manual. The manual has a copyright date in the 50s, so that's what told me this machine was made in the 50s. Um, but it works uh, well just for that motor clicking sound. So this is what I sewed on it today. So you can see it's something that that works. works. It does a uh, zigzag in lots of different widths and lengths. Uh, it sews on the left, sews on the right, does the zigzags on the left, right, center, etc. So uh, the zigzag is all controlled with this. It does uh, step center, that's left, that's right. And then you can control the width of your zigzag uh, through this here, control the stitch length through here. And this is the, I'm not sure if the light will let you see it, that's the fashion disc, one of the early models of the fashion disc for Singer in the zigzag pattern. You can buy other patterns, but I just have this one. You can see that the machine has uh, got a good uh, shine on it and some light scratches on the bed plate, um, but I put a new light in there so you can see that that works. It's sorry, new bulb, not a new light, but a new bulb. It's an LED bulb, so it's nice and bright. It doesn't get hot. Good shine elsewhere on the machine. It's not in perfect uh, shape, but it's in good shape. I'll give you a tour around the other side and then I'll sew on it so you can see that it works. This is the other side. Show you the front. Of course, you'll see it in pictures too, but uh, this is the other side you didn't see earlier. All right, let's sew on it now. It's gonna be a little tricky uh, one-handed, but I'll do my best. We'll do just a straight stitch first and a few different lengths, and then uh, we'll do a zigzag. I'll shorten that up. Make sure my needle is in the top position. Sorry, kind of on the wrong side there. You can see the short needle length. So now we'll lengthen stitch length. Uh, but do this nice wide zigzag. Sorry, camera's moving everywhere. All right, now we'll shorten up the width. Make it a little shorter so you can see. clicking in there so um, all right well that's what I just sewed there let me know if you have any questions